As long as there have been cars and bikes, there have been people painting them. And uh, they don't always call themselves artists, but they are every inch of it. Uh, my mentor, uh, while I was in art school, uh, was a huge Harley enthusiast. He always was always out there painting on the, the tanks and the bikes. You know, I got invited to this show, I just jumped right on it. I thought of him and thought I'd always wanted to try to, to do that. Yeah, I think one of the things that I was really excited about when I got invited to this was seeing what the other artist's take was, because I know that mine was, was a little weird, and so I wasn't sure if people were gonna go really cliche or really branch out and do their own thing. And, you know, fortunately everybody did their own thing and it was awesome. When I was first told that the theme of the show was rebellion, the art of rebellion, um, I had to scratch my head at first and think, what is that? You know, because rebellion can take so many different forms. My piece is about the rebellion I experienced as a young man in 1984. On the one hand, there was the punk rock revolution in the States, but at the same time, there was the Republican revolution in the other part of the States. Out of the whole rebellion thing as a prohibition. So I had this character who gets drunk off milk. I painted this this black and white hand, which is you know this authoritative hand, and it's it's holding in its in its hand this uh you know this this creature that's that's trying to get out. And a lot of my work ends up looking like explosions or things coming apart. Electric guitar through really loud, distorted amplifiers is, is always been about rebellion for me. Uh, I think rebellion is represented through the art of tattoos, you know, and just holding on and also letting go. Talking about freedom and, and motorcycles and artists, you know, artists don't really like to be imposed upon with a theme, so I'll have to say that I sort of rebelled against the theme of the show. I think a lot of people coming to this exhibition will have a great opportunity to have their minds perhaps twisted open in a way that they haven't had before. There's some of these guys in here that I've, I've looked up to for years, you know, Sean Barber and Shepard Ferry and Bob Dobb, and, and it's, it's insane. So finally to get a chance to show with them, it's awesome. Everyone had a different approach. Everyone sort of took this idea and approached it from a completely different angle. And there's so many different results that it really makes it for an interesting show. Um, I hope people that come to the show tonight are inspired to make art after seeing the show and you know even more inspired to go out and ride a bike.